My name is Daniel Muirhead, co-owner of Warhead. Uh, what we do is we just manufacture headwear. We, we create headwear, uh, hats, beanies, caps, primarily for the fight game, whether it be boxing, MMA, jiu-jitsu, whatever. Warhead is based out of Montreal. Uh, we wanted to um, bring some sort of what people call a European flavor to MMA. The way we came with Warhead was, at first we wanted to have a clothing line because we, my partners and I just love MMA, we love the sport of boxing, what be it, and uh, we wanted to come up with a clothing line that represented who we were. Um, we wanted to go into t-shirts, we wanted to do clothing, but we realized that there was too much out there right now, so we went to something we really loved, which was hats. And we put everything we wanted to put into the hats. We made it very uh, unique. We want to get away from what's been in MMA right now, which is skulls, daggers, you name it. We just thought of a W inside a splatter. Some people think it's blood, it could be blood, it could be sweat, it could be tears. Anything that a fighter really goes through. We just want to give something different. We want to be more trendy, more lifestyle. We started with a local kid, his name is Thierry Kenville. He's an up and coming kid. Uh, and then we went into UFC right away. We want to really brand ourselves as being inside, heavily inside this world of MMA. We started with Eric Schaefer, we did Pat Barry, UFC 104, and we just recently, December 5th, Ultimate Fighter finale, we uh, were on uh, John Jones and Matt Hamill. Uh, John Jones was wearing the gold splatter and Matt Hamill's camp was wearing the red splatter. Our vision for the future is every season, every new hats we're gonna come out with is gonna have a certain theme. For example, our next winter theme is military. Our hats will have that military-esque feel to it. I guess just visit our website, www.warheadwear.com.